Gilly and I'm on Atkins. Today I'm going to be making for you some low carb cookie dough. Now this is really quick and easy to make as we're just going to be making it in one bowl and we're not going to be using the oven. So what you want to start with is for one portion you want to take two small tablespoons of butter and about four tablespoons of splendor and put them in a bowl and then you're going to cream these together until the butter is light and fluffy. I use Lurpak Lightest because it's really low in calories because I've mixed it with vegetable oils. Then when this is all creamed together, we're literally just going to throw everything else in. So I'm going to take a few drops of vanilla extract. A couple of tablespoons of carbolose flour. Now you don't have to use carbolose flour, you can use soya flour or coconut flour instead. of tablespoons of ground almonds, which give it a natural sweet flavour. And then for my chocolate chips, I have chopped up three squares of the Cavalier milk chocolate sweetened with stevia, which looks like this, and a couple of squares of the Cavalier extra dark chocolate to give a bit of bitterness. I'm just going to throw this in. And then I'm just going to stir this all together. Now when you've done this, and the dough has made a quite a stiff mixture, you can eat it just as it is, just as a really sweet treat, or you can break it up into little balls and use it to make cookie dough ice cream. Or if you want to, you can put it in the microwave for 20 to 30 seconds so that it's like half-baked cookie dough and all the chocolate starts to melt. And then with that you can put a little dollop of low-carb ice cream, which I made in one of my other videos, or even some cream or yogurt. And then it tastes just like the one that you get in some restaurants. Now, if your mixture is a bit dry, what you want to do is just add a little bit of water just to bring it all together, which I have here. Really, just a few little drops. And hopefully it will all come together nicely. And for this, because I used five squares of chocolate, you can, it's got loads of chocolate in it, so when you put it in the microwave, it'll be really gooey and yummy. So, what you want to do is just, using your fingers, squeeze it all down to the bottom of the bowl, so it looks like one large cookie. in the microwave and it's as easy as that. If you want to make bigger portions of course you can just double up the quantities and put it in a, in a larger bowl and the cookie dough itself because there's no egg in it of course it's safe to eat it raw and you can store it in the fridge wrapped up in cling film for well up to a week and you can also freeze it and it will last forever really. <laughs> There we go, there's our warm cookie dough. I hope you enjoy making this.